welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Lexi. If you're new here or if you forgot, it's okay. I have a lot of energy and I don't know why because I haven't even had my coffee yet today. So as usual, I've been spending all of my paycheck on clothing and I've had a few things gifted to me, which is really nice. Thank you to Lulu's and Garage Clothing. But I wanted to go ahead and share some of these clothing pieces with you guys. Maybe it will inspire you to go spend your paycheck as well. I'm gonna go ahead and get to this video because no one wants to hear me talk any longer. Let's go. First piece of clothing is this top from IMG. It's been like very popular and very much sold out across the internet, but I finally found one on sale in a Nordstrom and then one online. That means I got two colors. So I not only have tan, but I have white. Next piece of clothing, it's not quite springtime yet, and honestly, I feel like this is too springy to wear right now, but it is really cute, and it's a very flattering cut. It's this cute little peasanty type top. I think it's adorable. I'm really excited to wear this when it's not 55 degrees and raining. Next is... <laughs> I can't talk today. Next is this top from Verge Girl. It's um, this like red snakeskin print has been pretty in for a while and I didn't know how I felt about it until I got this top. And it's not only super flattering on your body, but it's really actually cute and fun and spicy and it's a little more interesting than just your average white t-shirt that I normally wear. Next up, this top my mom got me from Free People. Got me this, it's like a surprise, and I think it's so cute. I love the little straps. It's a little small, and I thought it was gonna be cropped, but I happen to have literally no torso, so it doesn't even show my belly, which is great, because I don't wanna be showing my belly. It's winter, and your girl hasn't worked out in a while. Next, this top from Reformation that I got on sale, which is amazing, because they're my, like literally one of my favorite clothing companies, but I can't usually afford their stuff. It's this super cute top. I'm really into this lavender color. I mean, I'm into lavender everything. I have lavender tattooed on my body. In honor of that color, I also got this cropped little cardigan from Urban Outfitters. I just wear it as a top, like buttoned up. I don't know why I can't use my hands, but you'll see in the try-on section. And I love it. I also got this top from Reformation. <laughs> I've been wearing it literally every single day. I think it's the cutest shirt ever. I'm obsessed with it. It was also on sale. Next is this top that is also from Verge Girl. This top is super cute. I love the color. I don't even want to try to describe I, the color. I think it's like a salmon rustic orange. That's what I'm going with. The sleeves tie, which is super cute. And it's just a cute, fun piece. And I feel like the color makes it good for any time of the year, which we love. This top I got from Urban. I haven't worn it yet. That's why the tag's on. But it's cute. It ties on the sleeves at the top as well. It's just ruched. It's a really beautiful color. This reminds me of Mermaids, which is all I wanted to be when I was younger. Aquamarine was my favorite movie. This top is from Free People. I'm obsessed with this as well been wearing this a bunch. It's just this like, so I thought it was like an olive green, but everyone's been telling me that it's yellow or mustard yellow. So interpret what you will, but it's a really cute, just satin top, kind of cropped, kind of low back, really cute. Did I say cute enough already? And that concludes the tops portion. So let's move into dresses and sets. This set is just everything, everything in the whole world that's good and great. And so this is the skirt, I know. So it's a two piece set, like a flapper girl set. It's honestly just really fun if you're like out dancing with friends and you know, you don't have any dance moves like me, then all you have to do is kind of like shake around and flap dance and everything looks good because everyone's just focused on the clothing. This dress, this is like the prom dress of my 60s dreams. It gives me very like 60s vibes. It's just this gorgeous embroidered dress. I'm pretty sure this is what I'm gonna wear for Valentine's Day when I'm sitting alone in my room because <laughs> I don't got no Valentine. But it's super cute, I'm obsessed with it. I actually did some shots in it so you'll see those soon with Andre. Next up is another set. This is like clueless everything. This is the skirt, it's really cute. I love the chain, but it's cute. 
Then I got this dress that I was eyeballing for a while. I got it from Urban, but you can also get it from like a bunch of other places. It's this really pretty dress. I wore it to a baby shower because that's kind of what, what I felt like it reminded me of. But the sleeves are see-through or transparent and then it just has this really flattering, flattering dress part. But I love it. It was really cute. Then I have this jumpsuit from Lulu. It's super cute. I've been getting really into this color of like emerald deep green because I think it's really flattering. And my eyes are kind of green and it like brings out the green in my eyes. But I saw this on their site. I had to have it. It's then I got this romper from Lulu's. It's just a cute black fitted romper, very flattering. The back has a little bow and I've been wearing it with this fabulous blazer from Lulu's. Um, I'm really obsessed with just like the blazer look on girls. It's kind of like girl boss, woman empowerment style. I don't know, but I think it's really cute. It's really flattering. It's a super easy outfit. Don't even have to worry about styling pants because you just got a romper and a blazer. I got this from Garage. <laughs> I'm pretty sure everyone, every woman on the planet has one of these right now, but they're like the softest, coziest sweaters in the whole world. I'm obsessed with it. I've been wearing it all the time because I can't seem to stay warm. <laughs> even though I live in LA, like I don't even live in a really cold climate. So I don't think I could survive anywhere except for LA, honestly. This is probably one of my favorite things I have ever bought in, ever. Like she gets, she gets good usage. It's this jacket from Urban and it is the softest, most fabulous item of clothing ever. I'm obsessed with it. It's super cute. You can wear it inside out. Um, it goes with everything, the color, the style. It again is kind of like a 60s cut, which you know, vintage, very in right now. Unfortunately, I didn't pay vintage price for that. Next is this corduroy jacket from Lulu's. Super cute. I'm obsessed with anything corduroy right now, but it's just this super fun blue jacket. I love the color. I love the fit. It comes with an, a, a detachable like fur lining for the hood part, but personally, I'm not huge on fur, even if it's, even though it's faux, obviously. So I kind of just wear it without it, but it's always an option to style it up for nighttime. I told you I loved corduroy. I got this corduroy jacket from Zara. I've been wearing it a bunch. It's super cute, super cozy, and just like having something corduroy instead of just like a normal cotton or jean material, it kind of just like adds something to it, you know? Then I got a couple sweaters because you can't have enough sweaters. I got this orange one. It's like a rustic orange. I love it. It's super comfortable, a little oversized. And then I got this gray one that's just super soft, super cozy, super flattering. Both of these are from Garage Clothing. One of my favorite pieces part two is from The Ragged Priest. It's this outstanding cropped yellow rain jacket. It's like kind of transparent and see-through and it's cropped and it's so cute. But you can get this either on theragedpriest.com or on Dolls Kill. These super cute little shorts. I actually haven't worn them yet, but I think they'd be super cute with like a sweater and like black tights. I'm excited to finally style these up. Then I got this skirt from Urban, which I think is just fabulous. This like race car, like red, black, white, blocked, all of that is like very in right now. So I picked this up. Also, I think mini skirts are frankly very flattering. So had to have her. Then at Free People on sale, I got this really cute, just like white corduroy skirt. Again with the corduroy, I know. But it's super cute, super easy. It was like 20 bucks on sale and it just kind of jazzes up any shirt. Also from the Free People sale section, I got these shorts, <laughs> corduroy shorts. They're this really fun rustic orange color. I feel like I kind of have like a theme with like my colors in fabrics, but it's fine. I know what I like. I also got this silk skirt from Verge Girl. 
that I'm really excited about. Verge Girl, by the way, is like an Australian clothing company. Um, I'm obsessed with it, but it's just silky and soft and it's like a swing skirt. Then I got these pants from Verge Girl as well. They're just like the longest beach pants in the whole world. And I think they're fabulous and I'm obsessed with them. And again, this is totally like a year round item. And I do live near the beach, so they're perfect. Last but not least for clothing items, I got these white snakeskin pants from IMG. They don't fit me that well, but IMG doesn't take returns. So we're just making them fit, but they are really fabulous. I wanted them for a long time, but it, it is like this amazing snakeskin, like vinyl material print. And they just have zippers like all up the sides, all up the crotch. They're great, they're sickening. Last but certainly not least, I got a few pairs of shoes. So I finally, after my trip to New York, decided to give in and get some Doc Martens. These are the platform ones, and what's really amazing about these is they zip on the side, so you don't have to be tying them every time. I have probably worn these like every single day, but these are definitely my new favorite shoes. Therefore, I had to get them another color. I got them in white glitter as well. I actually haven't worn these ones yet because they're just so amazing and such a statement that I don't know which outfit I want to pair them with yet but they're literally just like almost holographic glitter. I'm really excited to be obsessed with docs. Then I got these Jeffrey Campbell go-go boots. Really excited about these bad boys. I'm obsessed again with like the 60s and some of the styling from back then. These are amazing, extremely uncomfortable, but kind of amazing. And then the final item to end this clothing haul are these shoes from Sam Edelman. It's this like really sick floral pattern. Bought them on a really good sale price. So again, had to have them. That is all I have for you guys today. I don't know why I have the feel the need to do like big gestures and jazz hands, but that's what I have for you guys. I definitely want to start doing more clothing hauls. I am very into fashion. I always have been. It's my dream to have my own clothing line one day, which would be crazy, but till then I'm just going to shop at other stores. Leave a comment down below what you'd like to see next. Leave a like, make sure you subscribe and turn on that notification bell so you can see when I post next. I'm trying to do videos pretty much every single day. So that means there will probably be one tomorrow. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for all your support. I have my Instagram and everything linked down below. I love you guys so much. Bye, guys.